Hi, it's me, Stephanie. Welcome to this edition of Stress Reduction TV. I am standing here in the beautiful gardens of Prospect House in Princeton, New Jersey, which was the home of Woodrow Wilson and many presidents of the university. Taking the advice of Cheryl Strade's mother, who said, uh, put yourself in the way of beauty. There is a lot of research on awe and resiliency. So if you've been looking for a job or you are feeling stressed, this working from home, the new normal, see if you can take yourself out of your routine, take a few hours and step out, get into the sunshine, find a place that's beautiful and just see if you can take it in. Finding a place to sit or stand and just observe how beautiful things can be even all the turmoil that's going on in the world. And I'm not saying to ignore it. I'm just saying that's happening and this is happening also. So to bring calm and a sense of safety into our nervous system, we need to reset. We can't always be on guard. Just a virus itself causes the nervous system to be on alert. The amygdala, the little sensor in your brain, that little watchtower is always looking for danger in the environment and we've been told basically it's in the air, in the droplets, in the respiratory droplets. So it's in the air that we share with other people. So we're wearing masks and we're on a nervous system level, we feel threatened. And then with all the riots and the violence that's going on and the changes that are happening. We're having all these growing pains in America for change that's coming. And it can be uncomfortable. It Change is always uncomfortable. So the nervous system's affected. And if we want to be able to participate in creating positive change in the world, we need to feel safe. If we can shift and reset, and take a few minutes every day in our daily routine to start to notice what is happening with the nervous system so that we can attend to the things that are very important and need to be attended to in the world. So we can use our compassion in action rather than just sit and say, I don't know what to do, I'm confused, I'm not sure, I don't feel good, this makes me upset. So let's just take a few moments just to stand here and maybe you can find your place maybe it's looking out a window or in your backyard or you could take a break for just two hours and go find some place to be take your shoes off put your feet in the grass feel the energy of the earth support you if you've never done that before I really encourage you to try so here we are, we're standing here, standing meditation. Feeling your feet on the ground. Look around. You might not feel comfortable about closing your eyes, but you can gaze down or you can find a beautiful flower or honeybee or something that is easy to look at. We're soothing the nervous system. You find the breath, feel the weight of the body drawn to the earth. That's magnetic energy, that's gravity drawing you down. And all the sounds in the environment, the wind, the sun, the sounds from the people around, it's all included. It's all a part of the aliveness of life. And can you feel yourself rooted down to the earth? And when your mind starts to wander or worry or plan, that's autopilot. Let's come into this moment right now. Let's feel the moment that we're in right now in this beautiful place with the sights, the sounds, the smells, the tastes. They're all right here to draw you into the moment. And if something in your environment is annoying to you or distracting, just embrace it. 
include it. We don't resist, we just allow it. It helps to let the nervous system know that it's okay, that everything's included. We might not like it and we might not agree or condone, but it is included, it is happening right now. So feel the breath slide down the back like a waterfall. The exhalation sliding down the long muscles of the back start to let go. And everything that comes up in your mind, could we let it go on the breath, on the exhalation? Could we allow the distractions, the thoughts that come up, could we allow them just to float, to wash down the back of the body like a waterfall? Or like a thought in the breeze, could we just allow it to ride on the wave of the breeze? Just taking these few moments to enjoy the beauty, to put yourself in the way of beauty, to help build resiliency, well-being, and until next time, be well.